There's always something buzzing here. And of course, we're digging into what's really authentic and a true community aspect here with a story of a Utah family of eight who biked 1,850 miles a lot of miles through Europe. Now this is the route that Dale and Brittany Majors took with their six children, ages eight to the three to fourteen, rather, and three other family members in their twenties. It started with a cruise boat from New Jersey to Europe, which took two weeks. Then they took off from southern France and they started heading towards the North Sea. In total, their trip lasted three months. Starting at the tail end of April, ending at the beginning of August, a little bit of homeschooling involved, we're told. Dale says he's been into long distance cycling since high school, then he and Brittany did it together and with every child since. Bike touring is very much a, every day we need to ride and get tired. We need to see something new. We need to enjoy good food. We need to stop at all the playgrounds. And as long as we average 30 miles a day, we'll make it to the North Sea. You'd have so many good opportunities of people like coming up to you and wanting you to come to their activity that they were doing and just lots of good opportunities for the kids to be a part of another culture and to see how other people live. And Well, all eight majors stay in the same tent every night. Brittany and Dale says it teaches family teamwork, builds more memories. They like the tent because you don't have to follow any other schedule but your own, no reservations. They also love meeting locals and other travelers at campsites. The majors say it isn't always smiles, especially on those uphill treks, but the lessons and the culture the kids are exposed to, they say makes it all worth it. They particularly remember the Furka Pass in the Swiss Alps. One of the hardest parts, which everybody recalls in a fun way, is we had to ride about 3,500 feet of elevation in one day. We all kind of wanted to throw in the towel. We all, all wanted to quit. Several people were like thinking about mutiny and how they could get back down the mountain. We love taking kids on adventures, you know, because just for them to see like, oh, I can do this. Oh, okay, you know, like it's just part of our family culture. Well, since they were talking to us, you probably know they made it through the pass and all the way to the North Sea. They say going with the flow and accepting that you really can't plan for everything makes everything go so much smoother. I think that takes a lot of guts on those parents to tolerate those children, takes a lot of right. tolerance from the children to tolerate each other and the parents. It's a lot of work. I, I can't imagine battling the, the weather elements too, downpours, sure. thunderstorms, I mean, that's no fun. Same tent every night. Who done it? You know.